Hey guys, Computer Stuff 101 here, also known as TechMac911, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Wine in Ubuntu 11.04. Now, what Wine does is lets you run Windows applications in Mac, Linux, uh, FreeBSD, etc. Et uh, what you want to do is go on up here, search for your terminal. Should be right here. Now, the first thing you want to do is type in sudo space add dash apt repository space ppa colon ubuntu dash wine. Then you want to add a slash and put PPA on the end of that. It's going to ask you for your password and while you type your password in it's not going to show you any characters or anything like see look I'll type mine in right now. I just typed mine in and it didn't show anything. Then once you hit enter it'll show all this stuff. Uh, total number process one imported one everything looks okay uh, so the next thing you want to do is type in sudo space apt dash get space update. Go ahead and hit enter. You'll start updating everything. This may take a while uh, depending on your internet connection. Alright, so now that it says done right here, what you want to what you want to do is type in sudo apt slash get space install space wine no space at all 1.3 go ahead and hit enter once you've done that uh... it'll show all this stuff blah 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 uh... it'll show you what new packages will be installed and what you want to go ahead and do is hit shift y enter now it's going to start downloading all this this may take a while again depending on your internet connection i have a relative, relatively fast connection so this should be done here in a, just a minute but i'm just going to go ahead and pause until it is finished Alright guys, once that's done, you should show up with a page like this. It's the end user license agreement for the Microsoft software. Uh, you want to read all this carefully. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to read it for you. You guys can do that on your own time. Just go ahead and hit enter. Wow, it's not... Alright, go ahead and hit an arrow key, then press enter. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, in order to install this package, you must accept the license terms, the true blah blah blah. Uh, do you accept these terms? Yes. Go ahead and hit yes if you want to install this. This will go ahead and continue. So I'm going to pause this and I'll be right back. Alright guys, it just now finished up here. So uh, once it's all done, it'll say all done, no errors. Hopefully that's what you want it to say, zero errors. Or zero errors pardon me. Uh, everything checks out okay, blah blah blah, all done. Uh, it'll start everything up, close out of it, and you should be done. Go ahead and type in exit, and it'll exit out of your terminal uh, session. Go ahead and go up here and search for wine. Now, here's what you can do. Uninstall it. There's tricks, and you can configure it. Go ahead and configure it to what your preferences are, graphics, etc. Um, so, yeah. Once you're done with that, um, you're pretty much done with everything. You can go ahead and run your Windows applications, games, Crisis games, uh, Modern Warfare. Those are some of the popular ones. Uh, yeah, or just Photoshop, something like that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if this helped you out, please subscribe, and leave a comment down below if you have any questions, or shoot me a personal message, and rate this vi or like this video. Uh, 
that would be much appre appreciated. Go ahead and subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace.